So the race we were looking at uh, before is in play and you can see that time and place looks like it's going to win at this particular stage. Late run from strategic and strategic forces got it on the line. I should be a race commentator. And then again, anyhow, what we can see here is that strategic forces won. We placed our trade on Whaley Station. That hasn't won. I don't know where that's finished, somewhere out the back. Uh, but we're still going to get our money because, of course, we had a profit of 28p um, on strategic force. Uh, and with that race over, then we would move on to the next race. So if we go up here, click on Select Market, the next race will be uh, the 10 past at Wolverhampton. So if I double click on that, you can see the market appears um, over here. And we can trade this market uh, before the start of that particular race. If you're interested um, in when that race is going to start, we can see it starts at 10 past 4 here. Um, if we take our mouse down to the bottom here, you can actually see that there's a countdown timer um, just at the bottom here. If I double click on that, you can see it actually pops up into a nice little, uh, well I say nice little, a nice big window that allows you to pin that and then actually store that somewhere convenient. So it could be on this screen, it could be on another screen, however you want to. And that will basically have a nice big number next to you to tell you how long you've got before that next race starts. So the countdown timer is available on the bottom right of the screen. Uh, but also, obviously, you can see here that um, we can tell what the time is anyway. But the countdown timer just acts as a reminder to when that race is underway. Now, we do actually have audio settings as well that will remind you five minutes out or whenever you wish about how soon the next race is. So the audio uh, messages can be configured from the settings menu. We'll talk about that in a separate video. But you do get an audio warning when the next race is upon you. And you get that for two reasons. One, not to forget to trade it. Two, that when you're trading, you know how soon you are and how close you are to the off. Because sometimes trading gets a little bit intense. Take your eyes off the screen and you may not be aware that the race is about to go in play. And if you're interested in trading before the off, do not let your bet complete in play, unless if you have a specific strategy around it. Um, but yeah, we've switched to the next market and now we can actively start trading that market.